this bout, bout number four after the exhibition. Oh yeah, they're getting hyped in the corner right now. AMAC, American Martial Arts Gym coming out of Waldorf. And they're ready to go. And they're used to fighting. I mean, when they do jujitsu, they're on the mat all constantly. And you can see that fight translate over, you know, like I said, a fight is a fight. Yeah, a fight is a fighter. So they're out there rolling on the mats, they're out here strapping up the gloves, putting on the shoes, showing their skills on the feet in the cage. Let's see what this gym has to offer. Two knockouts already. You know they're going for the third. Yeah. Here we go, this fight is going to be at 140 pounds. Exhibition boxing match. That's going to be three two-minute rounds. Oh, he's hyped. Oh, yeah. They got some steam behind him now. Yeah. His teammates paved the way. Oh, the same school again. Wow, this is just a straight up rivalry night. This is Whoa. team versus team all team night. AMAG versus KTA, Maryland versus North Carolina. So AMAG has to keep the streak going while Jeremiah Cole from KTA has to redeem his teammate. This is a movie, man. Yeah. Well, they look around the same size body type a little bit, so. About 140 average height for the weight. Yeah. Slim but cut. Oh, and already you can see the cold grills coming from Mitchell. Yeah, but he's tight. The little looks more height. set to go with our next bout of the evening. It will feature three rounds of exhibition boxing at 140 pounds. And once again, introducing the man in charge of the action after the bout wins, your referee, Adam Sawyer. All right, fight fans, introducing the principals first, fighting out of the blue corner. This young man is attired in black and green, weighing in at 140 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Introducing his opponent in the red corner. This young man is wearing the multicolored trunks, weighing in at 140 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, here is Jeremiah Cole. Three rounds, exhibition boxing, 140 pounds. Well, I'm getting goosebumps for this one. Oh man, you got Khalil Mitchell in the black shorts with the camo patch, and you have Jeremiah Cole fighting with the camo shorts with the red and white trim. Viable gems as far as tonight goes, because AMAG already has two knockouts over KTA. So let's see if Mitchell from AMAG can keep the streak going against Cole from KTA in round one. Oh, Cole coming out strong. Coming out strong. You can almost see the pressure on him. He got, his, he got his head down. If you keep his head down here, he'll, he'll be fine in that. Mitchell giving him a nice little smile. Yeah, they both. Because Cole knows he has a lot to live up to. I think might have a, a hook might have gotten through in there. The clinch against the cage. So at this point. Oh, body head from Mitchell. They, they have a similar style. I see Cole going more headshots. Mitchell's being a little bit more calculated, going to the body a little bit more. Body head, which works so good for his coach Hardiman. You can tell Cole has something to prove in this one. Ooh, nice uppercut from Cole. So, there's no jabs being thrown the whole fight. No, they're Everybody's, both in. Yeah, they all thrown. Oh, oh, oh. Mitchell's no after him. He's going to throw yeah. Cole looks a little wobble. But but he's um he's slipping some of those punches. Mitchell's slipping some of them. Now he's throwing the jab a little bit. But he's still in it. 
Both fights slowing down a little bit. Mitchell giving them a little bit of tongue action, showing them that he's still in the fight. So the thing is, when they get in that top, somebody has to turn the punches under. So it's going to... You got to turn them, turn them under right there. And you're going to still be at You can turn them under, get out, and work back in. See, they're going for the knockout. See, yeah, so when you just keep going the wild punch, you're going to miss some of them. Right there, that's what you should turn them under. He, so so if, if Mitchell makes the adjustment, he can change the fight around. Mitchell stays in tight. Looks like Cole's just trying to get a quick duck on. Oh, Cole is on the back foot now, rolling up as a cage. There's a lot of holding. He's going for the clinch. What is that saying? He's a little tired. And he's trying not to get hit. He came out strong. He wanted to redeem his team. But he may have put a nail in his coffin. We'll see as we end up this round one and get ready for round two. Man. Fast so, and furious. Well, yeah. So this is some adjustments to be made in this. But right now they're both going um, threes and sixes, hooks, hooks to the body, hooks to the head. So somebody makes an adjustment and throws some uppercuts. You said footwork to get in and out and can change the whole fight around. But they're going to tie that stuff up the way they're fighting. And he had a great point. It's like not a lot of jabs. Yeah, you can look at they both breathing. Oh, yeah. This is in there. He looks excited. He's thrilling. Cole is right there with his coach. He's getting some instruction, but you know the pressure's on him. Watching two of his teammates get knocked out by the opposing team. Yes. But the good thing is the rounds are two minutes, so they young guys, they can still put it on two minutes. And here we go. Seconds out. We're getting ready for round two. One thing I tell for sure is that both of them want to knock out. You can just see them in their eyes. A decision probably won't even be good enough for these guys. That, that round could have went either way, that last round. Yeah, I can't call it. Beautiful action back and forth, but we're getting ready for our round two. Well, because those hooks are coming, you have to keep that chin down. Back into it. With his hooks, right at killer range. It's a lot of hooks. Oh, Cole coming in hard. Yeah, Mitchell is Mitchell's one of the slow him up. And we saw Cole slow down in the first round. He has to be careful not to exert too much energy in the opening seconds. He is. Now, Mitchell's going behind the jab now. Yeah. That's a little change. Smart. They should hit him right there. Oh, nice. Mitchell turned him around, caught him with a quick hook. <sighs> Cole's playing a little bit of possum, ducking down. Uh, so now he, he's doing it. He's turning him under. Turn See him the under. adjustment? That's on a little sneaky Yeah, it's a little adjustment. See that? That adjustment changed the fight. There you go, that little sneaky uppercut. Yeah. Like I said, Cole. Now work your way up. back in with the jab. <laughs> See, instead of clinching, that's when you got a body. Uppercut. Then jab your way out, jab it back in. Right there. See that? See it? I, I, I think I saw Kenya Skinny it? Man yeah. saying the same thing. Yep, right there. Dig up that, that changed the That changed the whole fight. Now Cole is and up now the right there, you need to back out and work your way back in with the jet. You don't need to hold him. See, and Cole is right there. He's up against the fence. He's back against the but wall. But he's definitely tough because he's fighting back. You don't, The holding slows him up from winning the fight. Yeah, a lot to say Mitchell is kind of... Take yeah, it away see, right, right now when you get held, the guy has the opportunity to hit you. Oh, like you said. See, he gets back in the fight. When he gets grabbed, he gets back in the fight. Oh, there we go. Cole's coming back. Body, yeah. body, head. But his chin is up. You got to watch that. But his chin is up. A couple more seconds left in this round. That's a little stumble from the fighters. That's probably gonna, how we're going to end round two. They're fatigued if they fall. In. Whoa. A lot of action that time, but I saw, for one, more strikes from Mitchell. So right now, the first round, it could have went either way. I believe Khalil may have gotten that round. He, he, he ended it strong, but Cole came out strong. He did. Cole came out the fight. I mean, like, yeah. you say he looked a little fatigued in round one. These are young guys. Like I said, two minutes. Yeah. So they're just going all out, you know? Yeah. No point in conserving too much energy. But see, he did make the adjustment. That was smart. The second round, he made that adjustment. So if you keep that, he's, his corner's telling him. 
So if he keeps that same adjustment, and if he changes adjustment from throwing straight hooks, he'll be fine, but he had good head movement. Yeah, that's exactly what they're telling Mitchell in the corner, the people in A-Mag. Yeah, it's going to be a tough one. If I had to guess in this round three, we're going to see Cole coming in like a bat out of hell. And if Mitchell is smart, he can keep that distance and then come up the middle, like you said. And here we go. Round three for all the Boy, marbles. They know it. They both may come strong this round. And we're going to see how this rivalry for the night continues between KTA and AMAG Jim. AMAG right now with two knockouts over KTA. So if, if Michigan keep that jab out and not let him get inside, he can win it. With the long hook. Yeah, he got it. He got to stay busy. Cole's working in. Oh, yeah. Cole's trying to come right over top of that. Yeah, jab. but it's. Nice head move from Cole. Cole's using his feet. He don't need to grab. I like the defense from Cole. Mitchell's oh, now Mitchell's he should have stayed on him. But Cole's running around right now. I mean, Mitchell's running around. Yeah, Mitchell's winning the round. Yeah, there if he keeps the up. pressure on him, Mitchell's definitely winning it. And if he starts going to the body and mix it up, he had changed the game a little bit more. Because right now it's head shots. Body. He, he went to the body. Ooh, nice left hook by Cole. Oh, his Cole mouthpiece is coming out. In. Mitchell's mouthpiece is coming out. That was a nice left hook from Cole. He's going back to it. He's picking up. Well, so he got back in the round. Yeah, deep breath from so, both fighters. So now it's, it's even. About the last minute of the fight, we're going to see it once and more. It's probably the last minute. For oh. once and more, it's like a um, rock in Apollo Creed. Yeah, that's exactly right what it's now. like. Neither man back. Oh, they down. rustling over there now. Neither them back and down. They both got power cooled up. You know when the seconds come yeah. towards the end of the round. They're going to try to fight. This is Ooh. a fight. Nice one from Cole. This is a fight. Oh, he came back. Oh, he threw something Cole back. They both in the cut. fight. Whoa, there we go. They're Last few seconds. Fight. And we're going to see how this ends with a hook from Cole. Oh, Catch up from Mitchell, and that'll be it. Oh, it goes to the judges. This is the first time tonight. We've seen first the judges. First time tonight goes to the judges. But I have to say, I'm not mad about that. They gave action from yeah. start to finish. If it had to go to the judges, this is how I wanted to see it. Both fighters not backing down. I can't call that one, man. I don't know. I got to see what the judges said. First round was tough. I give Mitchell the second round. Cole had some clean shots in the third round. 